good morning good morning today we're gonna make a shrimp like seafood foil pack in the oven so let's go ahead and get into the ingredients now y'all can modify this as needed but these are the ingredients that I'm gonna be using shrimp mussels butter I don't have no potatoes so we're gonna just do canned potatoes onions green onions or scallions I don't have no regular sausage so we're gonna do a little bit of smoky um, them little smokies corn on the cob lemon pepper garlic hot sauce parsley ground pepper some creole seasoning tony saturies um pink himalayan salt some cayenne onion powder ginger paprika lemon pepper and butter of course what I'm do is boil the corn for about seven minutes since it is frozen and when it gets done then i cut it in half so we're gonna throw some eggs in here as well because some people like eggs in their boil all right, so right now we're just gonna thaw out the shrimp and I have shrimp with the heads on. I'm really not worried about these mussels because they're already cooked the whole way, so I'm just gonna end up throwing them in the oven with the rest of the stuff to cook. And cut up these green onions. I mean, y'all see what color they are. We're just gonna go ahead and cut up these onions real quick. until they're like a little golden brown and then I add the garlic. All right, so at this point you could decide to either leave the whole shell on without like deveining it or anything or you can just do like I did this one and just devein it and take off the shell. So I think we're gonna do that but I'm definitely going to leave the heads on. So we'll go ahead and start doing that now and I have a bag because honey, this stuff is stunk. So I'll just take off the shell, I'll use a knife and just, you know. All right, so now I'm gonna take two sticks of butter and let it cook down for a second before I start adding the seasoning. All right. I like a lot of ginger. At this point, you can turn down your heat. I have mine on like four, but you see my eye is red as shit. These things you have, you're gonna go ahead and add all your seasonings to it. And this is what the sauce looks like when it's done. Let's get back to the shrimp. If you got the, your shrimp the way you want it, all I do is put a little bit of seasoning on top. Just give it a little extra flavor and then just mix it in. Either oil or butter just to uh, put it on the bottom. So we're just going to make one. I mean, I'm going to make probably like four, but I'll show you how I do one. So let's go ahead and make sure we have corn, some shrimp, a couple of mussels. Since they're whole, you can just break that in half if you want. It's already cooked already, so all you're basically doing is just warming it up. We'll put a little bit of shrimp, some more shrimp. What am I missing? And seasoning. Some of these sausages as well. So I'll go ahead and add some of these sausages. Now the egg, I'm not putting that till um, the food's done. All right, so we're gonna take some sauce that we have here and go ahead and just slather it all on top. spoonful and a half. Make sure you try to get everything incorporated so when it cooks, everything's there. And if you want to add more butter, you can. If not, let's make it how you want it. Right, let's go ahead and wrap it up. If you need to do two foil things just to make sure that it's secure, go ahead and do that. 
just want to make sure it is tight. Make sure you tighten it real good so no air will get into it. and put it in the oven for about 30 minutes and we'll be back so this is what they look like we're gonna go ahead and put them in the oven for 400 for 30 minutes okay right, so it's been about 35 minutes and it is done look at that look at all that juice yummy and we're done all right so if you like this video make sure to give me a big thumbs up make sure to like subscribe hit that bell so you're notified whenever i upload a video all right till next time bye mm -hmm.